Hello guys, welcome back to the channel. I hope you all are doing extremely fine. My name is Prince and you are watching the tech stream. In this video, I am going to show you Evolution X Android 13 custom ROM and if it is stable enough to be used as a daily driver on the OnePlus 8 series devices and OnePlus 9R. So without wasting any more time, let's get started. I have installed a custom ROM called Evolution X on my OnePlus 8T and it is based on Android 13. If we check about the about info section, we can observe that the Android version is 13 and the ROM is Evolution X and the Android security patch is dated 5th Feb 2023. This video won't cover the installation procedure for this ROM but if you need a detailed video guide how to install this ROM on OnePlus 8 series device, please leave a comment below. This custom ROM is highly stable and boasts very responsive and fast performance making it an excellent choice for users who prioritize speed and reliability. It is worth noting that this ROM is designed to be used as a daily driver. You will be pleased to know that all of the basic features and functions work exactly as they are supposed to. From Wi-Fi to Bluetooth, NFC, Volt and calling, everything just works flawlessly on this custom ROM, making it a fantastic option for those users who value connectivity and convenience. While the fingerprint sensor and face unlock on this custom ROM work perfectly fine, they are a tad bit slower to the other Android 13 custom ROMs out there. As an Android 13 based ROM, it boasts a plethora of exceptional features such as material U theming, updated UI and transition one handed mode etc. Rest assured, every feature functions seamlessly without any hiccups or glitches. If we talk about safety net, this ROM does well in that regard and it passes safety net out of the box and payment and banking app work just fine. However, I have installed Magis on my device which is the reason my safety net test is failing. Moving on, this ROM also has a wideband security level of L1 which enables HD streaming on Netflix and other streaming sites. Next up, when it comes to camera, the ROM provides an AOSP camera which may not meet everyone's needs and unfortunately the ROM does not include Oxynos camera or gallery app like other Android 13 ROMs. However, on the bright side, it is easy to install a custom Gcam on this ROM. You can check out the tutorial linked in the i button. For gamers, this ROM delivers a great experience with 90 FPS on BGMI without any lags or frame drops. Comment down if you want a full gaming review on this ROM. Battery life is also an important consideration and this ROM performs well in this regard. There are no significant drains on the battery and the average screen on time is around 6 to 7 hours without heavy gaming or other battery intensive activities. Now let's take a look at the extensive customization options that are available on this ROM. The Evolver section in setting houses all the customization. Starting with the themes, there is Monet Engine which generates black theme and users can customize the color to their liking. There are also 7 different background color themes to choose from in the dark. A wide range of fonts and options for status bar, icon packs, signal icon styles, Wi-Fi icon styles and icon shapes. Moving on to notification settings, users can choose ambient and lighting. The quick settings offers customization for quick pull down, smart pull down, brightness light. Under the power menu, there are power menu item toggles. Gesture settings offer one handed mode, quickly open camera, swipe to screenshot, brightness control, and double tap gestures. Lock screen settings provide options for UD, FPS, fingerprint icon picker, animation effects, media art, and fingerprint options. Button settings allow customization for navigation gestures and volume rockers. And then there are options to change the screen of animation and charging animation under animation settings. Finally, miscellaneous settings offer a dedicated gaming mode, pulse music visualizer, burn in protection, and one plus settings including DC dimmings, auto high brightness mode, ambient display gestures, FPS overlay etc. It is evident that this ROM provides an abundance of options and customizations which can take hours to explore thoroughly. Finally, this ROM is very exceptional as it is the most responsive and snappy Android 13 ROM that I've ever tried. With this ROM, you can experience the stability of Android 13 while also receiving frequent updates and new features due to ongoing development, which is a great accomplishment for the developer who who is working hard on it. The current shortcomings of this ROM is the lack of Oxygen's camera support. Despite these issues, the ROM is still incredibly stable and highly recommended for everyone to try. That's all for this video. I make a lot of ROM reviews and I'll be trying another Android 13 ROM such as CR, Droid or Nameless. Subscribe to the channels to not miss those videos. Thank you for watching.